Hey everybody, Iceman50 here. So we're gonna see if we can get the uh, the scooter to start. Uh, we really need to get it over to the storage space and uh, get it out of here, cause uh, we're not riding it. So let's see if we can uh, get this thing started. We'll see you in a minute. All right, let's see if we can <clears throat> get this thing started. Call, kickstand up. Kickstand up. It's, uh, it's been a while since we started this thing. So I don't know if it's gonna uh, start up or not. Uh, I got battery. Break. <laughs> that doesn't sound good. Let's uh, let's get it on the center stand and see if we can kickstart it. Hang on. Well, that was fun. <laughs> I was able to get it up with my right leg. But uh, now I'm gonna have to try to kick it with my with my right leg. So turn that on. How much gas we have? Let's see here. This ought to be fun. Usually it's like a like a quick kick. That's not working too good. Try my left leg. It's on, right? Try a couple more times here. Oh, duh. Stupid kickstand. Hate you. That like does not sound good. Yikes. Let me see if I can get it started without holding the camera. I'll come back. Oh, I'm tired. This thing's fighting me. Now I gotta see if I can find the uh, we got a, uh, a jump starter pack that I got for Trevor. So uh, let me try and see if I can find that. It might be under the seat here. Let's take a look. Let me take a look here. Helmet, spare helmet. Screwdriver, that's important to get to the battery. Oh, hey, starting fluid. Hmm, we might try that too. Starter pack in here. Maybe he's got it in the Navi. Let me, uh, maybe we can do a little spritz on the intake or something. See if we get this thing started. You know, maybe we can give it a fighting. There goes a screw. One screw. Two screws? No! I'm losing more screws. There's one more screw down here. I was trying to get it. I guess I should have brought a magnet. We'll find them. They're in here somewhere. Okay. Oh, how cute. Oh, 
you see how messed up this thing is it has that's where i fixed it it got all blown out in there let's uh where's the key right here Switch is on. Okay. Perfect. Okay. Ah, that's, I'm sure that'll be fine. Nope, way too much. <laughs> Oh man. Now it's got starting fluid in it. Maybe we can. Oh man. Well, whew, I shut it off apparently. We got it back running. Left foot kick. Backwards. Got her going. We got about a quarter of a tank. We'll put that over at Trevor's uh, Navi. I got a uh, siphon pump thing, you know, you can stick in the tank. I was trying to. That's the one. There we go. There we go. All right, well, while it's cold here, you know, it kind of revs up and then uh, it should drop back down. Really need like a bungee cord, <laughs> bungee cord or something here. Let me, uh, We'll let this thing run and then we'll we'll head over to the storage space and uh, get this thing put up. We'll drain the gas over there. We'll see you guys. See if we can uh, shut this so the RPMs drop. Look, we only got a thousand and six miles. Point one and a half. Point point half. Alright. Turn it off. Let's, uh, let's see if we can start this thing back up. I don't know if it'll start, but we might have to kickstart, but it'll definitely kickstart. Hey! All right, let's turn that off. And then uh, I have to go inside and get my helmet on, and uh, we'll take a ride. We'll, uh, we'll see you guys when we get over to the storage space. All right, everybody. Trevor's in the Challenger. Oh, Ooh, these are hard to push when they're in gear. Well, not in gear, but all right. I don't know how much gas we have in here. I've got my siphon and I've got a gas tank in the car. Here we go. It's not too bad outside. I don't know. I'll pop the temperature up here. It's probably in the 30s. I am wearing my light gloves. We're only going 10 minutes away. I'm sure my hands will be cold, but it'll be all right. There we go. Oh yeah, <laughs> nice and cold. So, uh, what do we got going on? Well, first time in like a month that I got, that I sold some panel washers. That's pretty good. Business has really dropped off. I don't know, maybe during the winter here I might consider making some different uh, versions of the uh, panel washers. Maybe a little bit different design or something. I am also working on a... Uh, uh, what am I working on? Something with a filter. <laughs> I'm trying to think here. <laughs> um, something that a friend, Retro Blue, told me about. What was it, for Christ's sake? Um, oh, a uh, oil catch can. So I'm going to see if I can 3D print up a uh, oil catch can for the, uh, for the Gram. It would be for the non-ABS models like mine. There's in the uh, in the ABS models where where they put this thing 
it uh, that's where it sits and in the non ABS it's just a little blank off like tray I you know just a piece of plastic so but uh, yeah I'm, I'm fooling with that I had to get the whole spacing correct the next step is to actually like design a little container I don't know like I said I saw somebody else's attempt at it and uh, I mean it looks all right they want a lot of money they want like 75 bucks for it uh, you know so I, I think we can I think we could do better than 75 bucks and it has you know a little, one of those little tiny uh, crankcase breathers uh, you know so we'll, uh, I'm gonna take a look at that um, oh my neck is cold <laughs> Oh God! Uh, usually I wear my other hoodie. My neck is totally exposed. Usually I wear my other hoodie that covers up my neck. Either that or I need a... I uh, can't find my scarf. I was looking for that. Oh man. Yeah. My hands are fine. It's my... It's my neck. <laughs> He's still behind me. Oh, I'm speeding! Oh! <laughs> Slow down! <laughs> this thing only goes 60. This thing can actually do 60. Oh, yeah. Oh, eyes are burning. Fuck. It's a little cold. Oh, yeah. I think... Trevor and I were talking about it. We think... He's gonna hang on to this thing for a while. Um, you know, it's good if you, you know, maybe you're working on your vehicle and you need to take another vehicle, whatever. It's only like 600 bucks. <clears throat> like I said, we only got a thousand and, what is on here? A thousand and eight miles, so. We put on like 400 miles since we got it. That's before we got the Navi. I probably put the most miles on it. And, uh, yeah, I admit, we haven't changed the oil yet. <laughs> uh, I have all the stuff in my trunk. Uh, not in my trunk. Yeah, in my trunk. Or backseat. One of the two. I got, uh, some oil. Oh, you son of a bitch. Fucker. <laughs> Pulling out in front of me. I got the stuff in the trunk, in the uh, backseat of the car. Oh, God! <laughs> Man, those tra tracks are rough. So, uh, yeah, so... Next spring we'll we'll pull the we'll drain the oil out of this thing. Six hundred bucks, still a runner. We need to do something about the front brakes though. I mean now they work. Now it just needs new pads. Oh god. I was gonna look and see if I could get them from. This is made by a Rakuta or Rakuta. Um, see if I can get some pads from China or uh, you know look on Amazon or something. Uh, nice. It's warm out. I love her speedometer. You don't even know how fast you're going. It's in kilometers, and uh, it's not very accurate either. So I got a quad lock mount on here, so you can like stick your, so you can stick his phone on there, so you can actually know how fast he's going. I don't know. This feel. Jesus. What's up with people today? Feels like 30 ish. I tell you, even though this thing is bright yellow, people st <laughs> either they don't see you or they don't care. One of the two. Uh, yeah, we got. We don't have much gas. I don't know how much we're going to pull out of here. It's not going to be much. We'll try to leave it as empty as possible. We'll, uh, next year we'll uh, put some gas in it. If we want to pull it back out, we'll get some gas in it. I contemplated my wife driving this to work, but uh, yeah, she doesn't belong on two wheels. So <laughs> that's a no for me, dog. <laughs> I don't want to be scraping her off the ground. Uh, so I think we're just going to leave it parked. See, we're not that far away. Only a few minutes away. Oh, shit. Alright. Now, and now, the car bomb. 
Let's uh, gotta get my uh, app open here. Retry access. You're in range. Access granted. Come on. There we go. All right. Come on. Make sure Trevor can get through. Come on, buddy. He's through. All right, I'll come over here. Uh, turn off my turn signal. The blinker's been on since Kenosha. <laughs> guys we'll uh, we'll bring you back when we uh, pull the gas out of the tank we'll see how much is left we'll see you in a minute all right everybody so I got a uh, siphon thing off of uh, Amazon it's a cheapie it's got a little squeezer bulb I'm hoping this will work we're just gonna try and get <clears throat> get out whatever's in here so you know it's not sitting in the tank There's a bunch in there. I'm gonna take my gloves off so I don't get them uh, all crapped up, gassed up. Oh yeah, that's a bunch. Yeah, there's actually a bunch in there. Let's see here. I kind of halfway put this thing together already. It wasn't too difficult. It comes with these little clips. I had to, I had to uh, tighten these clips up. You just kind of tighten it together. Um, they were like too loose. You can see they're already kind of too loose on here but it's good enough let's get this stupid thing open i want one of those race gas cans you know the metal ones where you can just open it up those are the ones we used to have none of this bullshit with the the this thing i you can never get them to work let's see here all right it's even got a strainer in there wow all right so theoretically you just Stick it in. <laughs> That's what she said. <laughs> and then squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. She trying to, you know, steal gas. Is there in and an out? It looks like, I think I did it right. The arrow is pointing. Oh, this isn't going well. <laughs> Okay. Let's see. We gotta be down on the gas. Alright, right, let's try it the other way. I'll try it the other way. Hmm, you gotta love the fumes of gas. I know, right? I'm blowing air into it. I think I think you had it the right way, right? It may be, maybe it's just gonna take forever. Well, you gotta get the siphon started, which I thought it. Oh man! I'm well, if nothing else, we got the tube. We can just do it old school. Oh you know? <laughs> man! I really don't want to. I really don't want to. Squeeze it, Mater. Squeeze it. My hand's getting tired. It's no nut November. <laughs> <laughs> it's a struggle out here, guys. <laughs> oh, God damn it. <laughs> I'm left-handed. It works better. <laughs> I think this is a no-go. Come on, man. It's gotta be rocket science. I mean, no, it's 
looks simple. Uh, I don't even know why it even needs to be direct, like an arrow pointing. Right? You know? Like I mean, I guess maybe there's a one-way valve, but I think it's down in the bottom. Um, gotta cover this up first, maybe? Oh, maybe. Oh, maybe? You see any gas coming up the thing? Um, I'm not, now. I hear something, but I don't, I don't know if that's really doing anything. There is nothing happening. We're in there. Or... It's totally down in there. It's down in the gas. Here, pump with it without it being, you know, and then like, so pump, pump, and then, and then you know, yeah. Ooh, what the heck was that? I don't know. Uh, let's see what happens. <laughs> oh, gas vapors. It feels completely <coughs> open. Like I just sucked on it and it's open. I was just getting gas vapors. Mm, yummy. Oh. Mm. 90, 89 octane. Well, I guess uh, we're gonna forget about this for the moment. <laughs> Jesus. Oh, now my hands stink like gas. All right, well, I guess we'll figure that out another time. I just wanna get this thing in here. Oh, gross. All right. Why don't I get it in there? I mean, shouldn't this be reversed here? <laughs> oh, I, I got it. Mm -hmm. We're gonna have to come back another time and rearrange, right? Yeah. This is, uh, I don't know how we're gonna get all this stuff in here. Yeah, oh, God. I don't know how we're gonna get the Navi in here, boys. Uh, <laughs> all uh, my RC cars are gonna have to move. We're gonna, I, we really need a shelf, Yeah. you know? And then uh, we can put some stuff on a shelf and then we can move all this stuff. Because this is a 10 by 10. It's twice as big as my old storage space. So we were able to fit the Grom and this in there last year. So, but uh, I don't know. We may, just have to, we may just have to leave the Grom out. I don't know. I, I think we can make room. We'll, we'll make enough room. Like I, I, I said, I just need a couple of shelves. I'm just saying already how uh, it's cold out. I feel like winter is definitely upon us and it's going to be hell. This is, this is <laughs> it. I told you we were past the last the last week or whatever. Oh, let's uh, let's put this back in my trunk before I forget it and I run out of gas. And Oh, yeah. That... <laughs> Not that that's ever happened. <laughs> I would never let that happen. Oh, watch it. Oh, Jesus. It's going to take me out. All right, guys. Uh, where's the key? I got the other key. In my pocket? Okay, it's in my pocket. Let's, uh, let's get this closed up. <laughs> Uh, we'll come back another time and maybe I'll uh, maybe I should have fucking YouTubed it on how to use a siphon I mean seems pretty <laughs> seems pretty self explanatory right squeeze the bulb pump you up and then that's it oh we don't want to see that guys nope you didn't see that number that? <laughs> no <laughs> alright everybody we're going to get out of here we'll see you in the next one easy